All right, uh, set the scene here. Uh, two minute warning. Uh, Vikings up 20 20. Panthers got the ball. Um, they're deep in their own end there. I think they're inside their, they're inside their five. Uh, they're going to be third down and 10, I think, when they're coming back. <laughs> this should not have been any, sh there should not have been any sort of reaction video because this game should not be where it is. <laughs> this is the life we have chosen. <laughs> um, reminiscent somewhat of last week where it was like an unlosable game. And this is very different than last week in the sense that we have an eight-point lead. But this game too should be coming down to this. Um, but a couple of things happen. You miss a field goal that you maybe should, long field goal that you maybe shouldn't have even bothered to try. You give up like one big, crazy big Sam Darnold run, puts him in the spot for a field goal. Entertaining game here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Yeah, so. About the I, I'm defense. hoping this is pretty Third unstressful. Half this <laughs> it ends pretty soon. Please. <laughs> this doesn't, these don't always have to be life or death stakes. Come on. Third down and 10. Darnold from his end zone throws. Oh, he's dropped it. Once again, and that's been a big theme today. So fourth and ten. This could be the end. This could be a very short reaction video. It better fucking be a short reaction video. If we give up a four, the way this defense is played close this game tonight, if we give up a fourth and ten from inside their own five, I'm just not going to be okay with that. It's like it's gotten in his head and he just has not performed. So this is the game. We stop him here. We're three and three into the bye. Let's go. They still have a timeout, timeout too. For Carolina. They would have been able to run out the clock, that's, but instead, that's unreal. Carolina that's stays alive I, in Minnesota this, territory. This season. Down to a minute ten remaining. Darnold moving to his left. Has a first down and Ugh. more. Out of bounds at the 35-yard line of the Vikings. The pressure forces them. Out of the pocket, I love that he gets out of bounds, saves that timeout. There's Daniel Hunter getting double teamed. Harrison Griffin chose choose, chose to go underneath, opening it up on the outside for Sam Darnold. Remember, this drive started at the four-yard line. If this goes to overtime, I'm going to throw myself out a window. I swear to God. And converted. They're already at like the 35. I mean, this thing's good. They're going to get shots in the end zone at the very least. Darnold to the outside. Treble. The antenna receiver, Woods defending. Like, fucking Panther receiver calling for a flag there. That's They've done every fucking play. flag all game. Fuck you, whoever that was. 20 or 83 or 23 or whatever the fuck his name was. They send the nickel on the pressure. Fuck you. Rushes that throw and... Might have been a little early. I mean, oh, real fuck time. Off. They've gotten every fucking it's hard call. To say that that we've, or not. we've had we've had interference on our guys in the end zone, and they didn't call it. Either way, incomplete. Second down. One minute on the clock. Panthers trailing by eight. Second and ten. Darnold moving left. Throws caught. Oh, Anderson. Bounds. Oh, time's well, not really. Second reception today. Here's some sarcastic cheers from the crowd. <laughs> After dropping a bunch. 
Third down and six. Third and six, obviously. Four down two to twenty. I might bring the Billets. Field. This might be a Zim Blitz situation. They haven't done that much in this game. They haven't needed to because they've gotten pressure, but he's getting out of pocket now. So they might have to, might have to take a chance here because. Hey, better be looking good sometimes. I'll wow. take the drop. All right, here we go. Fourth down. Fourth and six. Just again, that has been a Christ common the theme line. throughout this game. The drops by the Carolina receivers. I was feeling really fucking good about I mean, this, got <laughs> this game until just a couple of minutes ago. Even with the ball, even with they had the ball back. Like. So it comes down to this. Fourth down and six. And now a timeout taken by the Vikings. Mm. Get that defense right, Zim. Unreal, man. They just they, they can't help themselves. They can't help the themselves but make every Rob game into a fight. This Rob is gonna be the, the scoop and score. This game Carolina. Um, a this is going to be the fifth game out of six that, that literally is coming down to like the last minute or the no OT. Seattle was the only one that Vikings wasn't. Led by one, and then after a Carolina turnover, Cousins connects with Adam Thielen. That gave the Vikings an eight-point lead. They just can't help themselves. This, 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 this is like last week. It was over. Quarter. Last week it was 16-6. It's over. This game is 28-17. The Panthers must the ball. It's convert over. on this fourth down. And here we are. To stay alive. Vikings with a bye next week. Panthers will hit the road to take on the Giants. That's some killer instinct for fuck's sake. I don't get it. All right, fourth and six. He's just, please, Panthers please, please. Get to the play. Play. One fucking stop. Win this game. Down. Empty backfield. Darnold on fourth down. I'm going to throw myself out of the fucking window. We just gave up a wide open pass inside the fucking 10. This, they're absolutely going to score a touchdown now. This, it's all going to ride on a two point conversion. And that's when you go for the fade route. Your best receiver on the backup cornerback, DJ Moore. It makes it worse that half this field is in shade. I can't even see what's happening. Gets out of bounds, still oh, have the time out. Oh, they could run God. We had him pinned at what the fucking four, four whatever, whatever it was. They could even run a quarterback keeper. First and goal from the seven. Darnold throws and so touchdown. Robbie Anderson. Wide, wide open. Absolutely as wide two. open as it gets. This is impossible. This is an impossible thing that's happening. Robbie Anderson, at the time they needed him most, finally comes up with the well, catch. Here's the two, but we know they're going to give up the two. And even if they don't, they'll probably give up I'm the onside. Going to Moore, wherever he is, I'm going his way. Down at the bottom against Cameron Dantzler. This is for the time. This is this is this is not possible. Well, we got 42 seconds left in two timeouts. Fuck, we did it last week. Great play call, Joe Brady. This is unacceptable. I'm sorry, I'm a Zimmer guy, and I'm not even saying this is Zimmer, but this is unacceptable to be in this position. 28-28. Oh man, we got a ball game, Kenny. That was exciting. This, this game was unlosable at 2817 when your defense is playing. And now they just, they just choked. Too, the so we can't. Find his way up. Right past Eric Hendricks for the touchdown. Sam Arnold throws it only when he could get it. And then that two point conversion, that was just a beautiful play call. Sam Donald and the Carolina Panthers. I want to have boring yards. videos. I don't want to. I don't down. want this to sh this should always be happening. Fourth and ten, they converted. That was the key play. 
Vikings led by 20, 11 with under 5 minutes remaining. They have the ball. I forget which what the circumstances the were. Back, was, I know there was a strip sack that might have been a strip sack. Now look, this is far they from try a long field goal. Offense. You probably didn't even need to try it. You miss it. You give them a short, a shorter field. They, they went down and got field a field goal, but still. You know, what a second half here in Charlotte. Um, get the ball again. They had a long pass to Conklin. You're on the their Carolina side of the field. Started at Just stalls out because we don't try to move it any further. The big play on fourth down to yeah. Ian Thomas. They end up Another having a punt, and they fucking pin him deep. Moore. So it's like, and then, and then Anderson, this happens. This is this is this, this is impossible. Point. This is absolutely impossible. Followed by the two point conversion. Wow, that was sensational. Great oh, drive, boys. The call. He's been under the rest all day. Oh, Sam Darnold. Fucking aneurysm from this team. Screw it, team. So now the Vikings, with two timeouts remaining, 42 seconds. Pass is caught by Osborne. He takes it out of bounds to stop the clock. Yeah, truth be told, they can get these little chunks because they have the two timeouts. You're talking about six seconds, seven seconds of play. You, you, can take you, these little you want to uh, bolster Kirk's two-minute drill bona fides? That's nice. Save another maybe maybe, maybe field we field don't have to force these so right shoot on the that. Because you make one mistake now against a good defense, and they're going to kick a field goal and beat you. The Vikings need to go approximately 34 yards. Cousins gets away from Brian run, Burns. Run. Cousins will pick up a first down. Oh, nice run. Ooh, that was close. He almost got taken down. And that would have been OT for sure. That was a nice run. That's one. That was one of the best. That's one of the best Kirk scrambles. 50-53 for Carolina. Had him. He slipped off him. Somehow misses yeah, the maybe that's the break they needed here. But they shouldn't need. Just right? last week, they should, shouldn't again, be this. They shouldn't have come down with this. Clock, even with all what of that. the fuck? And that's what I mean by these 10-yard chunks. Where are we up to? Maybe we're about to 40. 45-yard line, fuck. From the 45-yard line. Protect for Kirk. Cousins over the middle. Complete okay. to Osborne. Osborne, time out. And K.J. Osborne out. picks up another Vikings first down. To the 43, and now a timeout taken by the Vikings. All right, timeout. I mean, they're moving. They're moving the ball. When he goes deep, nice out there. Nice outlet to KJ. Nice play to Osborne. We're, 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 we're ticking at the edge of field goal range. 22 seconds remaining. There's Greg Joseph. Hit a 54 yard you, like, game winner. Even if we get you know, to a point where it's a long field goal and Joseph misses, everyone's going to be like, where Joseph blew the game? He's three for no, four he, today. His career he, long is fucking, 55. Fucking come down to this shit. We've reset the clock to 24 seconds. We are tied at 28. Yeah, if you're in Charlotte, I'm the Panthers' defense. It's feast of famine right now. I would go on pressure. It wasn't mad. Like, I would, last week happened so fucking fast, I was like shocked. Because I don't want to I'm mad. I'm fucking time. furious. Even if we kick a field goal at this point. But we still got to get some runs to, to even do that. From the Carolina 43, 43 run. empty backfield. Cousins, quick release. Catch is made by... D.D. Westbrook down to the 37 yard line. Right. I mean, they're, if they don't move backwards, they're going to have a field goal try. As the Vikings point. call their final timeout, time if they don't gain any more yardage, this would be a 55 yard attempt, and that is Joseph's career long. He did it last week. But it's, 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 this He's is different. It's outdoors. It's on grass. Week one against the Bengals, 53 yeah. yarder to force overtime. Now the next week against the Cardinals missed. I mean, it's, just, it's, just, it's just unfathomable that this is this, yep. this is coming down. And then the 54-yard game winner as time expired to beat the Lions. Yeah. Like, last I don't even blame him. He you know he missed push one wide the last time from 50. Like it ain't his. Like, it's not his fault. You're not gonna always hit these fucking the you know, long ones. You're not even gonna always hit the, the, the shorter ones. But with enough time to set up for the field goal. So it's not all about the sideline. Out of timeouts. From the Carolina 37. Pretty confidence, but... Cousins pass. There it is. Down to the 28-yard line. is caught right, by Thielen. All right, get up, As spike it, and here we go. To the line. As you said, Jonathan Cousins will now clock it. Yep. And give Joseph 
An opportunity for a second straight game-winning field goal. Shouldn't come down to this. Yeah, they were in yeah. the Panthers defense. They Joseph were in might a, miss this kick. Very tough situation because you this want is, to this play is a makeable field goal. This is this is again, this is short, much shorter than the one last week. For the Vikings. But how are we here? How are we here again? And this is this coming is down to a last second field goal by the Vikings when we were, we're we were like game. up seemingly this almost this will be a forty seven. One attempt, Matt Rule calls timeout. Okay. Timeout, so we got another 30 seconds or so before. Look at Zimmer, he's just bent over it. Like, he just, he can't believe it. And some of this is probably, like, I don't know what the... It didn't even appear like it was on the last drive, like it was, they were playing prevent. I mean... Vikings scored they were playing like a normal defense. And now the Panthers have scored here. the last 11 points. Wow. And still this here. Everything you I don't, I don't understand game. it. I don't. Some of it is State just dumb luck. I mean, up in a way, but I mean. Greg Joseph. We spent last season on the no. practice we'll, squad we'll, of the we'll, Super Bowl. Pack it all Tampa after the Bay kick Bucks. one way or the other. We're either going to overtime and this is going to be a very long video. Or, or we're about done. This is for the win. From the right hands, Joseph from 47, it is wide to the right, no good. You got an overtime. I honestly believe um, we have something yeah. to do with the game. I can't Last tell on these fucking five. these shots Today that we do if it was closer. Yeah, we were in Cincinnati last week, five straight missed field goals. Joseph with an opportunity to win it for the Vikings. Wide right. Just mm -hmm. wide right. It did miss by a lot. But... All right, let's get ready for overtime. What a fucking nightmare. Over the first five weeks, eight overtime games. Tied for an NFL record. You want it, and we're Over the first five time. weeks of the season, this will be our third in a row. With the Vikings and Panthers tied. I already know. It. 28. Yeah. That's why I think we have Anyone something to Anyone watching this will already know what happens, of course, but I know. Not and everyone stop. watching live knows what's going to happen. The Vikings are going to lose this game now. With an opportunity to possess and unless were, the initial possession results in a they, touchdown they were or a safety. The bye, three, they were going to be heading into the bye three and three, which I know is not initiated from upstairs. Um... They were going to have a nice offensive second half to hang their head on. You know, you can look they were going to have two ways a very good as defensive game to hang their head on. Because, the I mean, fuck the... When they needed their guys to step the, up the most, they did. Two scores Carolina had so you before give the fourth them quarter a here. Lot of credit One was on a fucking block punt touchdown. The and the other was something. after a fucking fumble. And Matt they had, like, 20 yards to go. Modified sudden death overtime period. Why do we do this, Vikings fans? Why is it? Unless the team first in possession scores a touchdown, there's a safety, or the team first in possession has the ball the entire 10 minutes of overtime period. Fourth quarter, timing rules apply. Each team has two timeouts, and all replays will be initiated from the replay booth. Helmet is heads. I know we're going to lose the toss. We're probably going to lose the game. They're going to score. Go right down. Start this time. Called tails. It is tails. Like to see. Get the ball. Maybe, maybe the show. Vikings win the toss. Just Tied unreal. at 28 Just in unreal. Charlotte. Overtime next. Uh, you know how some carriers give you so little for your older busted phone you just end up living with it? I don't think so. Verizon lets you trade in your I don't like the whole thing of like even a win one. feels like a <laughs> loss, so like if we, we win, I'm glad we you won. Like last week, we won. I'm Lemon. glad we won. People, we people say, oh, it feels Get just a like a loss. Phone on us with I just plans. didn't see it that way. Every this, customer, current, new, or business. I don't know. I might have a different opinion. If they end up losing this. Or I mean, if they end up winning it, I might have a different opinion. Obviously, if we lose, I'm going to... If we lose, I mean... Jeez. I mean, everyone knows what's at stake. Everyone on the team knows what's at stake. There's a, there's a, there's a world of difference 
between being two and four. You only get one first bite in a Kentucky Fried Chicken Sandwich, so you better make it the best one. In a matter of minutes. Which is this one here. And being three and three. Oh, but this one's a good looking bite too. Try the Kentucky Fried Chicken Sandwich today. I don't understand the meltdown here. But it is time for the final question. Who is some of it's some of it's coaching, some of it's just. Players making Basically mistakes. Anyone? We've made Sorry, a lot of mistakes in this game. A lot of fucking See, penalties. Only Udo has had maybe enough. the worst game much. I've ever Jessica seen. In the middle, offensive line half. Me? No. <laughs> what are you doing? Whatever. Also me. Great you know, LOL. However many, really however many fucking penalties he's had. Right, Trip Kirk Surprise in the backfield on what was probably going to be a touchdown. They didn't get a touchdown. Of course, uh, also there everyone's today. going to talk about now. In 2016, um, I was working with the Amazon warehouse is, uh, when my brother passed away. They were going for the two. A couple years later, my mother passed it was, uh, away. When they scored their After first touchdown to go to all seven, he went, he went for the two. And then he had to go for two. And then he went for two later. To, you know, so you're kind of chasing those points. I'm a medical get them. assistant, and I'm studying to be. Seems like other teams always get them. We never get them. We didn't get those points. We didn't, you know, that, that extra two points, you know, that, that would have meant Carolina did things differently. They wouldn't have kicked a field goal late in the fourth quarter when they did. Second time yeah. in NFL history, at least one game has gone to overtime. I'm glad we could make history for the NFL. Six weeks. I'm really happy for that. No um, lead is safe in the NFL. No lead is safe, especially not with the Vikings the last We're talking, it doesn't matter. you got five minutes left, two minutes uh, left. These games all come down to the wire. Vikings just left by 11 with under five minutes touchdown. remaining in regulation. In the game, look, I'll be happy on that, in that Kick aspect. Kick off into the end zone. Jesus Christ, man. Kirk Cousins and the not? Vikings will start from their 25. Makes... Vikings lost in overtime to the Bengals. Week no one. sense how we're here again. First overtime game for Carolina this season. If I'm the Vikings, I'm going back to look at probably Carolina fans who fucking left. They're probably not even... Look, the look at that fucking stadium. The look at the stadium's down, going. They all left because they the knew this game was over. Ben, big doses of down and, cook. and it's not. And we're in overtime. And we're one bad offensive series away from... Giving them the ball when all they need is a field goal. Right, Viking start from the 25 yard line in overtime. Catch made at the 31 by Thielen. That's his 11th reception today. Gain of six. Yeah, and Thielen, he's had a tremendous you know, this, game. It, it, it now, ruins Justin what Jefferson's was a great, a great quiet. defensive game. And I know we're not playing. We're not, we're not playing. We're not playing the fucking the Bill Walsh 49ers here. But it, all game. his defense was great until the very end. See Frankie Lugo, one of the big reasons why the Panthers the were able to make it sacks, come back. Pressure the pressure all day long. Pretty decent against the run. Yeah. And then it just implodes. Second down and four, it's Cook. Robin Cook. All right, first down. Um, um, picks up a Vikings first down. There it is. Yeah. Up the gun and offense, down like, as bad as he is, if you told me they, they're going to put up 20 points on the road like a, against a good defense, and Panthers' defense is pretty legit, I would have said, yeah, that's what I, mean, so I picked them to score 27, they scored 28. But I'm not, Cook returning today, like, missed two of the last three games. It's been so ugly at times, yards on the ground. but it's, it's impossible to me that. They set it down for the Vikings in overtime. Tied at 28. From the 36 yard line. Cousins with time. And, that's, that's and then he fires out of bounds. That was smart. It was a two man route. They were trying to get Justin Jefferson on the over route, suck those linebackers up. Linebackers did a I mean, good job. some shit with the refs today. Pissed me off. Like, they're not. Kirk Cousins does a good you know, job throwing the football. There was away. one drive where they were just calling third down penalty. Phantom third down penalties on us every fucking series. Cousins over 300 yards. still forced him to punt. For the third time this season. You know, a couple that could have gone our way. But again, we were, we're 2017 with the ball. With, the with, I don't even remember up. what the time was. There wasn't that much time left. Maybe five, six minutes. All right, second and 10 and 36. I hate doing common live commentary on games because this shouldn't be a game. Justin Jefferson makes the catch and he's tackled at the 43 yard line. Decent play to Jefferson. Kubiak has really got to get get over his love of wide receiver screens, man. These things they they've thrown. I don't even know how many they had. A couple of them work, but a couple of them didn't work. And now we're in a third and three. Right now, third and short, he can get that quick first down for you. I mean, look. If you don't get this, you can probably First flip field position, but you just had it inside the five with the game on the line on fourth and ten. Vikings smartly put both receivers down at the bottom. 
Third down and three. Five. Cousins looking that way. Optimism. Now he throws, and it is KJ Osborne who makes the catch. For a Vikings first KG down Osborne, in he's become, he's become the new Jarius Wright. He is clutch. That's a huge, huge first down there. We're, we're we got it now. We got it inside the 45. But oh, we don't want a field goal because a field goal doesn't win. It. Not yet. A field goal could win it eventually. But Justin Jefferson isn't there. You're always going to have this guy coming into your vision as essentially a deep check down. Osborne has made some big plays today. Over 500 yards on a really good defense on the road. And we're here. I think these, th these things don't make sense. These things don't add up. Truck taken down by Jermaine Carter after a gain of four. I mean, at least it's a good thing. It's like, they know, you can't just play for a field goal. You have to play for a touchdown because, you know, the fucking field goal doesn't win. So I'm wondering if that's what they're trying to do right now, or look, just keep pounding it and pounding it. And you can pound it all you want. Pretty close to field goal range. Four. See Matt Rule. Four. If you just run, 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 you're probably going to end up in a third down. A touchdown would win the game for Minnesota. A field goal, and Carolina would have an opportunity. Here's there you go. Cook. Cook. Inside the Cook. Mm, okay. Take it down at the 20. Oh, love Dalvin, but Jesus Christ, man, he has gotten it. He, he is caught from behind all the time. First down. That's, that's, that is a game-ending touchdown. Okay, he Cook is, 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 is his that's normal why they missed him. Alexander Madison, he'll get you, you know, maybe half of those yards. He's not as explosive. But uh, I'm not going to rip Cook. Like he's he's, he's ending up with really good numbers. The football, They're 140 the yards, and he got a touchdown. Cook to the sideline, uh, 24 yards away from victory, but we were, we were one fourth and down, fourth down stop away from victory, too. So. Jeez. Stop. Can I, can I communicate with Clint Kubiak through the phone? Stop calling wide receiver screens. Stop it. You're lucky, you're lucky Jefferson didn't get knocked crazy there and fumble the ball. Because that thing would have gone the other way. And then it's over. I mean, that's as, that's as bad as a negative run. Like... Three I mean, we're running the ball a little bit now, so why, why are you even doing Madison that? remains in for Cook. Second down at 13. As Cousins throws. Osborne, touchdown! Vikings win! Yes! Oh, fucking, fucking team, man. I bet they're going to review it to make sure you got the ball over, but I think he did. scoring plays are reviewed. Greg Rolstad will take a look. Kirk Cousins connecting with K.J. Osborne. Oh, God, what a throw, what a catch. And I'm pretty sure he did get the thing over, but I can't tell from that for it sure. It looks like he crossed the plane. You hit that. It is part of I, I don't see how he didn't. If that, if he, <laughs> Jesus Christ. They're going to review it. All right, this will this will show it for sure. But if KJ Osborne hits I mean, the yeah, pile on as he does, yeah, he ball's breaks over. the plane. I mean, that I don't know how they could. <laughs> wow, it's a happy ending unless they, well, unless they, unless these refs come back and say otherwise. But even if they do, we got a first and goal at the fucking half yard line. The officials are going to look at this replay for too long. That looks like a touchdown. Kirk. Maybe it's all worth Mike it. We Brown, get the Kirk game-winning drive. Well, they got to look to oh, see if he completed shit. the process of the catch. A, he got control. B, he got two feet down. Think, then he took an additional step. But... Then reached across the ball, got it over the top of the pylon. I think it's a touchdown. All right, thanks, Mike. What a fucking dime throw by my man, Kirk. Jonathan, I know you agree. Kirk, it's all I worth it because Kirk agree. got a signature game-winning overtime I know it's a touchdown. touchdown drive. If they come back with something different... Well, just fire I me. Happy. <laughs> I'm relieved. I'm also pretty happy, but all of the players God, going around. Figure some shit the out field, by the Panthers Vikings. have started what? to walk across. The ruling of a touchdown has been confirmed. That is the end of the ballgame. 
KJ Osborne. The KJ hero. and Kirk saving our ass last week. It was Greg Joseph it, with Kirk and Thielen and everybody saved our ass. This time it's KJ Kirk saving our ass. We're three and three into the bye. We got the win. <laughs> It's, it's fucking ridiculous that it comes to this, but hey, <laughs> the wins are what matters. Get the fucking win. We got the fucking win. We got it in a very nerve-wracking and exciting way. I'm not happy that it came to this. I would have been perfectly happy having a nice, relaxing uh, post-game video instead of a nerve-wracking reaction video. But hey, at least the reaction video has a happy ending this time. It didn't have a happy ending in Cincinnati. It didn't have a happy ending in Arizona. It's the million-dollar pro football frenzy from Grand Casino. Score weekly prizes, monthly prizes. I'm going for like 30 minutes here. I'm gonna, I'll just do like a like a recap thing later on for all my loyal subscribers. Um, but Jesus Christ, man. It's time to fight the flu. And when you come to us, you can count on We need... I, I would like calmness care, after the buy. That would be my, my number one request, considering now uh, advice, you can five of these six games have basically services. put me through uh, shot, stress, stress that I don't need. And COVID testing. But we take the time to really get KJ, to know our customers. Got it done. Your health matters to us. Three and three. And we'll always got a tough road win. So you we beat a winning bankers. team who I guess aren't Visit winning anymore because now we're getting a lot to unpack which we'll unpack with a proper Working reaction video Charlotte. later. Vikings Maybe they got some post-game here. Cousins to Osborne, 34-28 Minnesota. Kirk, Kirk 33 of 47, 373 and 3. Cousins, 373 yards in the air, three touchdowns. Huge day for Cook, Thielen as well. For Jonathan Milva and Sarah Walsh. Good game for Thielen. Albert, State Farm post-game coming up next. Wow. Once upon a time, there lived a princess with really long hair. That's a vi Vikings victory for y'all. <laughs>